dance for the Intergalactic Space Dance Competition. There's only one more day till it begins. Ooh, hip hop music. Now that would be a cool dance to learn. Come on, everyone. Give it a try. It's called popping. without music. We need to find music. Um, uh, hey, that sounds like we've got a mission. And you know what that means? <laughs> it's time for us to pick a planet. but we broke our stereo. We need to find a place that plays music so we can learn a dance routine. Oh, I love dancing. Let's see if I can help you. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops? Nobody knows. Oh, pirate planet. A pirate adventure would be exciting, Orbit, but it's not the right place for practicing a dance routine. Oh, I really like playing board games. Board game planet sounds like fun, but I don't think it's the right place to find a music player, TK. What about this planet? It looks and sounds like it might do. You chose music planet, <laughs> the perfect place. Get ready for countdown. until we find one that suits your cool wheel. But we only have one day to the competition. There's not enough time. Come on, we'll find something we can all dance to. Ooh. 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 Ooh, the macaroni. <laughs> I love this one, and it's simple. Come on, everyone, get off your seats and try it with us. Ready, everyone? Here we go. Raise your right arm up. Now your left. Right hand on your tummy, and then your left. Right hand behind your head, left hand behind your head. Now, wiggle your body like a noodle. 
right hand on your bottom, left hand on your bottom. Swing your hips to the left, then to the right. Are you all right? That's it. I quit. I'm terrible. I'll never be able to dance. But TK, we can't enter the competition without you. <sighs> TK, I promise we'll find a dance that's perfect for you. You'll see. Let's try this record player. Hey, check it out. Rock and roll box. I love rock and roll. you high enough to reach, but it wouldn't be very safe. Aha! A car jack. It's used for changing flat tires. We can use the jack to lift you up. <laughs> wow! There's a lot of songs to choose from. Oh, this one sounds like fun. It's called the Robot Boogie. Whoa, I've never heard music like that before. <laughs> it sounds funny. That is a funny sounding song. What do you think, TK? I just look like a silly robot. It's no use. TK, that's it. That's the perfect dance for us. The robot. Oh, how fun. TK, show me how. Oh, 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 me too, me too. Looks like we found our dance, everyone. I'd say that's mission accomplished. Yes, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> we were trying to find a dance for the Intergalactic Space Dance Competition. So we traveled to the Music Planet. There were all sorts of music players, and each one of them played a different style of music. We learned so many cool new dance moves. We needed to find a dance that would work for all of us. We then tried a dance called the Macaroni, but without hips, TK couldn't finish some of the moves. She was getting very discouraged. So 
then we tried dancing to rock and roll. All of us really liked it. But I got a little carried away and hurt my foot. That's when we found an old jukebox. We never gave up. And guess what? We found the perfect dance for all of us. The robot dance! Good mission, Rob. Well done. We'll be just in time for the dance competition. And a buckle up. Five. for pirate treasure. Let's see if I can help you. Round and round the planets go. Which one stops, nobody knows. Ooh, lunchtime planet. Yum. A healthy lunch is important, but I don't think we'll find pirate treasure there, TK. Now that looks like a place where we can find pirate treasure. Yes, the Buccaneer Planet. Buccaneer is another name for pirate. Get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts. for. No way. 
way of knowing which way east, south, or west is. We don't know where we... <laughs> what was that? <gasps> I don't know, but I don't think we should wait to find out. It must have been some sort of jungle animal. We should keep moving. What's the next clue? Oh, I know. East to Ear Cave. I remember because East and Ear both start with the letter E. But which direction is East? We can't just keep guessing. Hey, TK, don't you have a tool that can help with directions? Hmm. Compass, yes! It is four main directions, just like a map. North, east, south, and west, right? And a compass's needle always points north towards the North Pole. No matter where you go. See? So if north is that way, east has to be this way. East, ear, cave. This rock looks just like a giant ear. We found ear cave. of a skull and key. Just like the one on the map. Ooh, that's so cool. cool. It's our voices bouncing off the walls of the cave. It's called an echo. It's called an echo. Hello. Hello. Tell us where we are. Tell us where we are. <laughs> treasure. <laughs> Finally, after all these years, you 
you've helped me find me precious treasure. I buried it for safekeeping, but lost me map. <laughs> 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 Not only did we find the treasure, we also made a fun new friend. I'd say that's mission accomplished. <laughs> mission control? Yes, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? So we went to Buccaneer Planet in search of buried treasure. Buccaneer is another word for pirate. Orbit taught us that a map can help you find things. But something making a scary noise found us instead, so we made a run for it. We learned that to read a map properly, you need to know what direction you're going. TK had a compass that showed where north, south, east and west are. That way we could follow the clues on the map. In the end, the scary noise was just a friendly robot pirate. He made strange noises because he couldn't find his jaw. That's what the treasure was. Well done, everyone. I'd say that means it's time to head home. isn't all about winning. You have to have fun and play fair. Hurry, everyone! Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts! Five, four, three, two, one. 
this planet. Rocket Riders, choose your racer. There are so many to choose from. TK, which one should we choose? Wow! Look at that one! Ready? Buckle your seatbelts! Uh, Mom, come on, she can't run. Get set, go! Rob, you can't just start like that! You're supposed to wait for the start signal! It's okay, Emma. We'll catch them in this. I checked them all, and I'm sure this is the fastest.
went off the track. That's cheating. You cheated! No, you cheated! You both cheated! Don't you get it? If you don't play fair, this is what happens. Neither of you wins. Cheating means you're not really racing at all. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> Sorry. No, I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Hey, we're really sorry, guys. We forgot what the real spirit of racing is about. It's about doing your best. And supporting your friends. Not leaving them behind. Way to go, Squeak. You're a great racer. You played by the rules. And you know what happened? You won. We got to bring our pods back to the starting line. It's a long way back to the rocket. I'll race you. <laughs> <laughs> Mission control? Yes, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> well, we wanted to have a practice race to see who is the best racer. We decided Race Planet would be the perfect place. We also learned that if you break the rules, it can be dangerous. But the most important thing was that you shouldn't forget about your friends. And losing to your friend is still a bit like winning, because you can be happy they did well too. Well done, everyone. I'd say that means it's time to head home. <laughs>